Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. As you can see, I'm ready for another Swatch Fest. I've already confessed that I had um, some serious hauling going on this month because it was my birthday. And um, I got real lucky on this next batch that I'm going to show you. Brave's Diva Polish has, um, she had a bunch of her polishes, <clears throat> excuse me, um, on sale. Uh, I think she's making room for some new collections and uh, she wanted to, you know, make room for the new polishes and so anyway I jumped on it and I've got 10 polishes two, four, six, eight, yes 10 polishes I would like to swatch for you today so with that said I've got all my popsticks ready my bottles are open and I'm ready to rock so I'll be right back and we're gonna get started on this alrighty I decided to speed this one up through the swatching this first polish we've got is a very light baby blue and it's called boys of summer I just decided you guys didn't want to sit through two coats of 10 polishes um, at regular speed so the next one we have is called drew and it's this beautiful light yellow you know yellows are notorious for being a booger bear for formula but this one was pretty good the next one we have is one of my favorites, and it's called Gatorade Bath, and it's like this pinky peach, and it's just really a beautiful shade. I'm really, really impressed with this one. And now we have Mad Dog's Ugly Christmas Sweater, which is a bright pink. Very, very you know, I'm into the pink, so you know I'm loving me this one. Next we have... Pete Van What Are You Wearing? And it's a beautiful green, kind of a bright green. I'm really liking it. And here we have Mirth. And this is a great, sorry I'm out of focus. This one's a great, you know, kind of a, I don't know, neutral. It's just going to be great for, um, you know, nail art. And this one's Big Lead Chew. And it's just a beautiful baby pink. And, you know, I'm always curious about these baby pinks. And this one's Lawn Seats. And it's a real light green. Kind of a minty green. Beautiful, beautiful. All of these polishes just knock my socks off. They're just gorgeous. And this one's Seventh Inning Stretch. And it's kind of a super light purple. I don't know like a lavender I don't know you know I'm not real good at describing them I'm good at playing with them just not describing them and this one I love the name sunflower seeds and it's another yellow and it's a very light yellow very nice very good formula for a yellow and we're gonna go back and we're gonna do our second coat of each one this is boys of summer and look how this builds up. It's just beautiful how oh, how smooth the formula is and how it levels out. It's just perfect. And there's that one, Boys of Summer. And we're going back to Drew. I was so excited when she put the sale on because I have filled up my cart and talked myself out of them. And just, you know, I've got so many polishes I want to buy. There's Drew. Final. There we go. And I just, I, you know, I always talked myself out of it because I wanted everything. I wanted everything that she made. So, um, since I couldn't order everything, I always just kind of skipped it. And when she ran this special, I was like, oh, no, we're getting into this. We're getting into it now. And this is Mad Dog's Ugly Christmas Sweater, the bright pink one again. I am really loving her polishes and I'm really excited about her um, new polishes she has coming out in August and this is the Pete Van what are y'all wearing I just think that it's just such a cute name she gives all of her polishes such cute such cute names of course I'm not a big baseball fan so a lot of them are kind of lost on me and this is Murph but on her website when you look at the polishes there normally is a description of why the polishes name that, you know, where the inspiration for the name came from. As you guys can see, I'm getting polish on the back of my hands because I'm not letting them dry. 
It's okay though because we have nail polish remover. We'll be good. And this is that light pink and two coats and it's good. Big Leak Chew. Excellent formula. And this is Lawn Seats. Going in for that second coat on it. I'm really excited to water marble with these because I've seen um, like April with the sparkle water marble with them and some other people and they're just perfect. They just do such a good job. Lawn seats and then seventh inning stretch. Real light purple. Gorgeous. Loving it. And then sunflower seeds. I'm going to get some more of that polish on my brush. I'm being stingy again. Here we go. Sunflower seeds. Very pretty. Dokie, I am back and I am done with all the swatching. Let me move this so maybe we can get them all in the frame. Sorry, I should have done this before I turned the camera on. There we go. Pretty much got them in the frame. My final thoughts on this. Um, all of these were two coaters for me on the swatch sticks. And um, except for Drew and um, Sunflower Seeds. Yes, yeah, Sunflower Seeds. I'm having trouble today thinking. These were all beautiful. Um, one thing I love about the Braves Diva Polishes is that you can water marble with them. You can stamp with them. They're just um, multi-talented polishes on top of being beautiful. The formulas were great. Um, like I said, I only ended up, and that could have been, you know, if you do thicker, thicker coats than I do, then you might get away with two coats on these. So, with that said, I hope you enjoyed this, and um, we'll go check out Terrace Polishes over at Brave Steva Polish, or Brave Steva Nails. I will leave a link to her YouTube channel. She does nail art, um, and she does collab videos and, and all kinds of stuff like that. But I will also leave a link to her uh, nail polish store. So if you're interested in any of these lovely shades, you can go check them out. That is all I have for you today. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.